Good morning, Aries. How you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing good. Welcome aboard the Cosmic Chariot. My name is Tyler. How you guys doing? All right. So today we are going to be checking out what Gaia has for you for messages. All right. Aries, Sun, Moon, Venus, and Rising Sun. Aries, Sun, Moon, Venus, and Rising Sun. And not all messages will resonate, but take what resonates and leave the rest behind. For that being said, if you want to enter in the giveaway, um, like the video and comment your Twitter app, and I will, or Instagram app, but you gotta specify which one, you will, which, which social media you are using. All right, and I'll message you on that social media when I announce the winner. I just got the prize today, so I'm going to be sending that out as soon as I hit 100 subscribers. All right. So, yeah. Let's get... Now, let's get right into the reading. All right. So, you got Temperance in Reverse. You got the King of Pentacles Reverse. You got the Two of Wands. And you got the Fool card. All right. So, you could be feeling a little unbalanced, a little, like... You, you may need to ground yourself during this time, Aries, because you are feeling a bit ungrounded, a bit unbalanced, and you just want to have fun. You know, you want to, you're tired of waiting. You just want to have fun and like take a leap of faith towards something because you aren't, you know, you're tired of worrying and like think, like being in the mind, like in the headspace, all right? So I'll be using three decks in this uh, video. So we got the Dreams of Gaia Tarot, we got the Rider Wade deck, and we got the Gaia Oracle cards. All right. So let's see what the Dreams of Gaia Tarot has for you guys. It was weird. The last reading I did, which was Pisces, like I couldn't shuffle this deck like at all. And, like, now I'm shuffling it, no problem. And it's, like, I guess Spirit just wanted, like, certain messages to get out there. <laughs> I mean, that's how it usually is, right? But. Ah, uh, there we go. Okay. So, you could be a mother figure. Got a lot of cards here. <laughs> All right. So you could be a mother figure and you're having a hard time listening to your intuition because you're not sure what you should do, but you just, you want to feel like the hero, you know, you want to take action towards something, but you're not sure what, you, how you should do it and how it can be very balanced for you. Heaven and earth is here. So you could be uh, trying to take a more spiritual path. Uh, one that's like not likely for other people to take, one that's kind of unusual, and you're finding your Ace of Wands, all right? Which it's the Ace of Dragons in this um, deck, but the Ace of Wands is the fire energy. So you are trying to take action towards something that's unbelievably like satisfying, something that no one else can can do besides you and that could be you know being a mother you know even though that's not really like a lot of people can do that but um it's just some it's a goal that you've always wanted to do and yeah you've always wanted to be a mother you you know you wanted to have a child and you know maybe that your partner could never give you a child and now that you finally figured out how to become a mother without, you know, giving birth or whatever it is uh, that you ha are dealing with. Um, but yeah, so you your masculine and feminine energy could be the thing that's unbalanced. So maybe you want to feel more motherly. That could be it. Maybe your feminine is less. Maybe you're more masculine than feminine. And you want to be more, like, balanced in that way. 
but you're not sure how to really balance yourself out. So you're seeking guidance from others to really figure out how you can be more girly or if you are a masculine, how to be uh, more balanced in your energies because you just, you're not sure uh, what's weighing you down. Um, but if you want to be more feminine, I would su suggest um, growing some plants, like try things like super easy, like um, because each plant has its like difficulty ranges. So you want to do something more like easier for your first time rather than like a tree. All right. You don't really want to. Wow. That's Aries. It won't hurt your heart anymore. Pisces full moon reading from conscious evolution journey consciousness evolution journey all right so i am subscribed to her so i just got the notification that uh she just posted a new video and it's funny that i'm doing aries uh while that while that notification popped up so it definitely go watch her video if you haven't already she is an amazing light worker and she just like I don't, so I'm not going to like speak for everyone, but whenever I watch her videos, like I'm always like, uh, resonating with what she says and understanding. So if you haven't like, or if you aren't already subscribed or watching her videos, you should go, uh, watch her videos. They're amazing. <laughs> All right. So let's, uh, so you're seeking guidance and, you want to be more grounded, more spiritual, um, more motherly, all right, rather than more masculine, because maybe you've dealt with a lot of masculine. Wow, I'm, uh, so maybe your, uh, your, what is it, your animal totem has bears in it and a turtle, because I'm getting, I, I've never seen the bear in this deck before, but right there it's there's a bear so maybe um you have a lot of bears in your animal totem and uh, tortoises or turtles you know which is very wise very knowledgeable and also there are a lot of spiders in this reading so maybe you either have a fear of spiders or you just uh spiders is one of your animal totems which is probably the case because yeah. Or the you can have both. <laughs> you know, it doesn't really matter. Or just it could possibly mean that you have a lot of clearing out to do, like a lot of cobwebs, you know. Maybe you need to do some uh, spring cleaning even though it's turning fall, but <laughs> attachment, letting go, restrictions, fears. So yeah, that kind of goes hand in hand with that spring cleaning, like letting stuff go, uh, cleaning stuff out that needs to be cleaned. A positive, the message, positive news, positive outcome. So you could be receiving messages and understanding that uh, you can become more motherly, more and whatever it is you're trying to accomplish, you're going to receive good news about it. Achievement. You are going to be achieving your goals. Just keep focus on your dream. All right. So yeah, nice, easy, simple reading. All right. Just focus on yourself. Focus on your dreams, and good things will come to you. You just, you just need to release a few things, let go of fear, and you will be all right. All right. So Aries. I hope you guys resonated with this video. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe, and namaste.